silk arrived in France around Renaissance, coming from Italy and to Lyon. Lyon kept the fabric part of the silk and Saint-Étienne took the ribbon part. There is a, an expertise in the region of Saint-Étienne around ribbons. Silk ribbons at the beginning and now all kinds of ribbons, of course. This company, Julian Four, started in 1864 with my great-grandfather. It's a family name. And so that's why today uh, I am here in front of you, uh, the fifth generation at the end of this company. We have kept old machines that uh, uh, wove silk ribbons for years and years and decades and centuries before today because these old looms have a way of weaving that on modern looms you can't make it. Trudeau came to see us in 2009 and they wanted to see if we could develop for them a very exclusive strap. If you want to have a nice quality in a textile strap, you have to use thin yarns in a big quantity. If you use big yards in a small quantity, well, you get a textile strap, but it's cheap. On these looms, you will get only six meters a day. And in one meter, you have three straps. That gives you an idea of how long it takes to have a big production. When we use our technique, what is important to know is that the type of yarn we use, the number of yarns, we cross that to get this specific thickness, this touch, how comfortable it is, and how durable it is compared to other textile traps that you can see on the market. When you have 150 years of company behind you, you can see what has been done by your predecessors. When Trudeau came, this was exactly what we had to do with them. Use our know-how inherited for years and years and enrich the product. I do think that these textile straps are very, very different from others that you can see on the market today.